Okay, channel, welcome back. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. It's going to be a different kind of video. This is what I like to do, kind of instructional videos too. I'm going to show you how to take something from PS4 and edit it onto PC. How I do it. I use Share Factory on PS4 and then I use Wondershare Filmora on my PC. I, I put it on a flash drive. But let's get started with this. What I'll do at first, not that, I will edit the clip. Edit, trim the clip, kind of like this. Once I got it where I want it, this is the video we just did, Blitz Play Setup. What, why I was uh, editing it in Share Factory. I was also recording this part, so I was multitasking. Brilliant, I tell ya. All right, you got that clip done. Add another clip. Let's see where you want to do that one at. Let's see where you want to do that one. Edit it. I leave the volume that uh, PS4 puts on there. I leave the volume alone and then I'll edit it in Wondershare Filmora. That's the way I do it. Now I also put music on and my music level I don't have over three. So it's kind of low. It's not blasting. I see these people do intros and outros, and the music is just, holy Toledo, it is freaking loud for about 5 to 30 seconds. Holy Toledo. You know, and then they're talking really, really low. Doing the intro. And you can't hear them, but the music is just over them, big time. I try to even everything out. All right, like I said, I put it in there. Now you can also uh, add um, overlays, which is something at the top of the video, like I did um, thank you subs. I did that in Share Factory. Now, this is how I've made my intro and outros with the snow on it on Grand Theft Auto V back in December. I did something like this. And then I put the overlays in, changed the color, this, that. Welcome back. Thank you for watching. Yada, yada, yada. This is how I did this. I like Share Factory. The only thing I will not record from there and upload to YouTube. It is not very kind to wireless microphones for some reason. It is not very kind to them. That's why I use the Wondershare Filmora. Now, on the PC, I will use either Fraps or Millis Action as of my uh, capture software. The Millis Action I like because I can do live streaming from it. The Fraps I can't. You know, people think I can just do a video like in no time. I say nay nay. Not correct. There's a lot of factors in this. How long it takes you to edit it. How good of a handshake you got with uh, YouTube. You know, you're going to have to have your YouTube channel and password and whatever stored into your Millis Action. I mean, not your Millis Action, your uh, Filmora Wondershare. This way, when you upload it, boom, boom, boom. Now, like I said, I have a couple uh, safety nets on, on my YouTube. I have YouTube. I have it going to my cell phone if somebody tries to get in and then I got a couple other little secret 
secret deals. Alright, and the thing I tried to I tried to do a uh, uh, a desktop thing to show you what I'm doing in Filmora, but it did not record the audio. Maybe I'm not doing something right. Darn you, Joe! Bad, bad boy! <laughs> yeah, he just always got to do something like that. Now, after I put... After I, I'm finished with that, I will go into the capture gallery on PS4, clip the video that I just did, hit the options button, and upload it to a uh, USB flash drive. And then there I have it for my PC to use. This is my desktop. Yeah, I know I got a lot of games, a lot of Steam games on here, some programs, this, that. All right, this is Wondershare Filmora. This is what I use. Now, let's go start a new thing. I will show you how I do it. There's my there's the clip we just did from um, PS4. Now, if you you can edit this also. You can make it shorter, longer, just like on to the Share Factory. On the Share Factory, just the same thing. Now, you can um, also um, click on it and uh, disconnect the audio. And you that's how you set the audio in uh, on to... Um, Wonder share. If I'm doing a PC one, I will click on it and uh, enhance, auto enhance, and I will also make it uh, 14 something frame rate. See, right there's my videos. This is what's on my USB. And then I also have music. I use YouTube's non-copyrighted, non-arbitrated music to put on here. I have like 1,500 songs that are on my computer. And the next video I usually do is the last song I did in the last video. This way I know where I'm at. I do it. A, B, C, B. Yeah, yeah, all that garbage. Now this is how I record my videos. And I'll record it. I try to have my mic in this video, but I couldn't record this. I don't know, maybe it's something else I gotta go through with it on um, action. Maybe something I'm not doing right, it's okay. I don't usually use it to show people. So hopefully you're learning something from this. Now I set my, um, right here is what I was talking about. Is how I set my um, video parameters. I'll set the sound parameters. My audio I usually keep at about 60%. You know, and like I said, the music audio is about at three. Um, the game audio, eh, about 70 or so. That's just how I do it. But, you know, maybe you got a quicker way or maybe you got a capture card. Maybe that works easier for you. This is what I do. Uh, Filmora, Action. And fraps they're like 30 bucks each so I got like a hundred bucks tied up into this so far all right you know how this goes and that's all folks <laughs> hope you learned something there I hope you enjoyed the video 
I thank you for watching. You like her? Give her likes up, please. See how high we can get them likes to go there. Adults and kitties, the trolls would love it. Feel free to leave a mature comment ready G per third. Want to see more videos like this or others that are on the ch channel? Don't be shy and please subscribe. See you in the next video. Tally, flippin' heck.